What's up? What's up? Look, we got swag. We got merchandise. We got it's a not guest for hat. sale. We got a guest <laughs> hat. Look, look, look. We look. got a guest. <laughs> Hold on, I can't do this. <laughs> Triple quad, right here. So this show is uh, brought to you by Mr. D here and Mrs. L. <laughs> They're about to have a baby any yep. day now. Um, and they got some stuff for us to unbox, unbox and review. review. And uh, hopefully they won't hate us after this because nope. they already bought the stuff. So if we don't like it. <laughs> so we said nothing's premeditated. It's live. All right. So uh, what are we doing? We're unboxing stroller. Stroller and car seat. Car seat. The Nuna line. Nuna line and a playpen. Nuna Mix 2 and the Nuna Baby Pipa. Mm, here we go. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. So we're gonna do unboxing first, um, then we're gonna do pretty much a review of the product, and uh, stay tuned. Got it. Just don't take a shot of the bill because it was like. No, there's no bill here. No bill. I think so. Box in the box. No. Okay, ready? Recording? Yeah, it's recording, man. Perfect. So Luna Mix, what, what color? Caviar? Caviar. It's uh, black. Black. It's a color black. All right, let's start this. This is uh, Mr. D's product, so we're giving him the honor of unboxing this. Pull it up. Mm -hmm. Got the seat. Yep, the seat itself. Cumbersome, heavy. <laughs> Wheels are on the top, guys, so be careful while opening it, it doesn't fall off. You need big, strong men. <laughs> there you go. Alright. Hopefully your baby is gonna be as happy as this one. <laughs> Plastic covering. You got one tire up on this side. Styrofoam for the handle. We need some like conversation during this unboxing. Absolutely. <laughs> so did you guys did you guys actually get to play around with it like at the store, push at the it store, around? Yeah, we uh, we played around with it. Uh, got some good uh, comments from the, uh, the sales people. It's uh, one of their favorites. Cool. And uh, seems to be selling pretty well. I like the newness stuff. They're very uh, stylish. Yeah. So the wheels in the back. All kinds of wheels. And this looks like the brake bar, the brake system on the bottom. You got another tire up on the bottom. You got another tire up on the bottom here. Clean up, clean up, everybody, everywhere. <laughs> How easy job. Yeah, just stand here with the camera. We're gonna, we're gonna remove all the plasticking, lay all the parts down on the floor, and we'll be right back. Hey guys, we're back. All right, it's out of the box. Uh, what you're looking at is what you get. Two front wheels, uh, two rear wheels, wheels. Woof. It's only 8:30. Uh, two front wheels. Um, not too sure. The clips probably for the car seats. That's what we're thinking. Uh, the foot brake for the actual stroller and uh, the stroller itself. Uh, when we unboxed it, some of these smaller products were tucked inside here, so we have to pull it out. And the manual. So next step, we're gonna put it together. Let's see how simple they made it. We haven't done this before. You saw us unbox it. We'll see how simple it is. 
Uh, it's me, Zambos. Three boys trying to put a stroller together. This is what all moms dream about right here. Live. Live, it's happening. So, according to the manual, we got the stroller frame, the rain cover. I don't see it. It's probably pre-assembled inside. Uh, the front wheels, the rear wheels we have. The adapters, what it's for, I don't know yet. We're, again, we're assuming it's the Nuna Pipas uh, for, the, for, the, for the bucket seat. The stroller canopy visor, I don't see this. Maybe this. Yeah, I yeah, know. This is it. That's what it is. Uh, the AM bar is that. The brake assembly and the foot muff. So that's the foot muff. So, seems like we got all our pieces. And here we go. Step one. Unclick. Step two, open. So, Darren, I'll let you do the honors. Your stroller, big man. Click here on the side. Here it is. Ah. On one side only. So the coin is this on one side. Alright, perfect. Oh. Alright. Okay. Officially became a high chair. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, step three. He wants us to open the back flap. Oh, let me come around. Darren, we'll just do this again. Okay, doesn't say how or why, but that's what it is. Mm. Got it? No, that's from the behind it. I think this is, they just want you to open this part, I think. Ah, through the four? Okay. Yeah, I think so. Completely open. Yeah, okay. that's what there it you is. Go. Okay, number four. It says click, click, click. What exactly? Let's try to figure it out. Click what? I have no clue what it's asking you to click. click. Maybe click, click these things in? It is kind of loose here. Let me see. This is this seems loose, so this yeah, is what makes sense that loose. it have to ah, click into something. Here. Okay, I see what it, what it is. Oh, oh, hold on, we gotta come around the other side. We found we found out what to do. Okay. So this thing here yeah. is loose and looks like it goes in here. Oh, well, it clicks right into there. Yeah. Okay. So I'll click it in. There, you there go. we go. Should we okay. just the other side? Same thing on the other side. Yes, you see the little clicking yeah. in there. Beautiful. Those two clicks are done. Number five, they want you to do the two front wheels, which is the two small wheels. All right. So, so is uh, there a left and a right? Probably not. Let's see. That's a good Does question. No, I don't think so. Right it. Okay. Okay. So it just clicks in? Yeah. Way too long or something. Unless there is a left and right, so try it on this side now. Yes, there is left, right. So yeah. don't force it. One side doesn't go in, it means it's the wrong side. So you gotta swap sides. And it looks like you could also take it off with the little button here. Alright, there you go. Alright. So it's the front wheels. Next step. Okay, they want you to put the brake. Lever. Okay. So we gotta flip the stroller the other way. That thing. Looks like it. Looks like it's got some nice sports suspension here. Look at that. <laughs> Alright, so it's gonna click in here. Hold on, move this. I'll let you again there. Just slide it in. You have to hear two clicks, so that was good. Slides it pretty easily. Yeah. Just gotta right. slide in evenly though. Yeah. <clears throat> so now they're, yeah, they gotta put in the wheels. The wheels? Yeah. Doesn't look like it's left and right. <clears throat> you have to push the button on the top. Maybe not. It looks like it. No, you don't. There you go. All right. Same thing on the other side. So you have to make sure the slots line up with the holes. Yeah, there's a groove. <clears throat> okay. 
There you go. Beautiful. Next step. Not sure what it's telling me. Something to do oh, with... Can go around? Oh, you see here? Unclear. This step is really unclear. What is it trying to tell me? Does yes. it have to button itself somewhere? Yeah. It probably goes around here and buttons on itself. Over it? Yeah. That, that looks like that, that makes sense. Yeah. I would recommend tilting it so you're not killing yourself. Three? So yeah. wrap it around the bar yeah. and pin it in. All right, now. Number five is the crossbar for the baby. All right, so let's look at it together. Here we go, Mr. D. So this goes in the front. So. It looks like it's going inside. Here. Okay. Right here. So inside there's two grooves here. Hold on, let me get. So this black on black's a little bit tough. Uh, let me got my cell phone, put some light on this. You kind of, you see it. You see it? Yeah, it's right here. Little plastic. Plastic piece with grooves on the side. Oh, there we go. go, that's better. So here, this piece right here. And then on the other side it would be, you wanna shine the light here? I would assume this that one. Oh, here's left and right. Okay, yeah. so this goes here. You so can there is see a here side. it says L for left. Where? Yeah. So right where my so finger is. It, it would make sense because you don't want the baby the oh, fingers to get stuck. Oh, there. Right. If you put it in the other way, you can so play with it. You got an. Ooh, what focus. You got an L, L and an R. And an R. All right. Okay. Click. Click. There you go. Got this bar. Done, packed in. Number seven. It's going pretty smoothly. Yeah, I think so, yeah. It's going pretty well. Click, click. Mm, these buttons here. So these buttons are our next step. We want you to clip on this button with here. That's it. And I'm guessing the one on the other side too. Yeah, so they look like they are Adjustable over time, maybe when the baby gets older, we'll soon find out. All right, next step. Securing your child. Hmm, we have a problem. We don't have a child. <laughs> <laughs> but we can simulate. Okay. Kev, get in. Hmm, I might have outgrown this a few years ago. So, this thing looks like the Rubik Cube. <laughs> okay. Uh, here, hold this. Oh, there we go. It's already done for us, which is pretty cool. It's not your typical stroller setup that I've seen. Uh, maybe. No, it is. It's just there's a circular point over a over over flat. It's like a five point racing harness. I like this stroller. Good job. It's like a race car. All right, so the baby would, do you have a tutu? Any tutu. Anything will do. So now if you're gonna do this by yourself, you wouldn't be able to hold hold that up and put the baby in. You're gonna have to leave it down. Yeah, you have to pull it from the back, but that's a common issue with all strollers. That's not a problem. They should do like seat belts, like retractable. Mm -hmm. So how do you rate the uh, the assembly so far, Kev? Very straightforward, straight to the point. Uh, the the um, the visual aspect of the manual is really well well done. One two points were a little bit uh, unclear, but easily figured it out. Miss Vicky's. Mm. Yummy. Focus. 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 Ah, we're gonna be the laughing stock of YouTube with a basketball. I love it. 
Yeah, but you can be there inside the box. Okay, alright. So, here we go. Pretty straightforward. So this would be going over the shoulders, like so. This would be going over the lap, like so. And then this side clips in. And that side clips like that. And essentially do the exact same thing on the other side. Like this, like that. And there goes my watch. There you go. Beautiful baby boy. Well, technically, baby ball. That's All it. safe and secured. Next step. Now it's for adjustments, but we're not going to go through the adjustments now. We'll do that during the review. The rest is all adjustments. Adjustments, adjustments, adjusting the recline, incline. Okay, perfect. So that's, that's it. That's the assembly. That's the assembly. Now, inside the manual, they don't talk about these products. Well, this they do, but they didn't talk about these two products. I'm assuming they're assuming... Is that like for the winter where you put it on the feet here or something? Yeah, uh, they don't talk about it. So, let me see here. See, they're all, these are all accessories. They're in the accessories section. It's not part of the installation. So the base stroller is this. You're looking at it without the basketball. Uh, these are considered accessories for the stroller. So we'll read about it and then we'll, we'll tell you all about it during the review process. All right, to wrap up this uh, unboxing uh, installation, so, um, honestly, the instructions are really good. Uh, we're, I have no one noticed we're Canadian. Uh, so it comes in English and French. I'm assuming in the US there's a Spanish section, but this one doesn't have it. Uh, really smooth, uh, very simple. Uh, three guys figure it out, so clearly <laughs> very easy to do. Um, the only, there are a few pictures that's not that clear, but once you pay attention, it gets done pretty well. Uh, the only thing that I have to point out during this, uh, I would say, assembly is the canopy visor. There's nothing mentioned about it in this manual. Zero. They don't talk about it. The only thing I tell you is that it's in the box. So it's kind of free for all. You got to figure out what the hell is happening. I went through it five times. If someone finds out something about it, or maybe they changed the manual, so be it. But at the moment, there's no discussions of where it goes, how you put it, and so on. But we figured it out, so we'll show you on this video. I'll let you do the honors, Darren. Right. So the zipper part goes on the outside, and then it attaches from one end where the zipper is. So it's easier if you fold out the, uh, the canopy so you can zip it up and all the way around. Voila, so that extends the, the canopy by a little bit. Block all the haters out. There we go. That's it. That's where it goes. So yeah, nothing mentioned in the book about it. Um, apart than that, really smooth installation, uh, assembly I should say. Um, this is considered an accessory, um, we're not going to put it on right now, uh, we'll do that during uh, our part 2, uh, which is going to be the full review of the product, um, and uh, did we forget anything? I don't think so. Nope. I think we're good to go. That's it. Shoppers Therapy, Guest D, Zamboth, TQ. So, uh, stay tuned for review now. Yeah. Now, now's the tough part. Now you yeah. now you know if you got your money's worth. Nuna mix two. <laughs> Nuna mix two.